Hi, and welcome back to The Mentored Engineer. I'm gonna share with you today my second favorite uh, engineering resource. All right, so uh, this book here is the Mechanical Engineering uh, Reference Manual for the PE Exam by Michael Lindeberg. And man, this is one of the, the few books that I've read cover to cover. Just kidding, I've read lots of books that cover to cover. But uh, just look how thick this thing is, man. It is a wealth of information, and yes, I have read it cover to cover. Uh, I've done most of the problems in here too. Uh, and you can see I've found it useful over the years that I've tabbed all these uh, different locations on all three sides of this uh, so that I can reference these things in the future. I use this book a lot. All right, now, so one thing is, is I have the 10th edition and I will keep this forever because this is the one that I actually studied through. I recommend that if you're starting out, you should get your own copy, but get a very newer edition. Uh, the reason I say this is because this edition was purchased uh, actually before I got the PE exam and it was before when the PE exam had the afternoon session of four one hour questions. The exam now has uh, six minute questions throughout the whole exam, both morning and afternoon sessions. All right, so uh, get yourself a new one and go through it and take it in. Uh, you could take this whole book into the exam with you. And I referenced it quite a few times during that exam. So without going through the whole thing, uh, you know, page by page or anything like that, because that would take way too long and you, well, let's just face it, you're not all excited about it as I am. All right. Um, it goes through everything. It starts off with, uh, with math and you go from algebra through calculus all the way to differential equations. Uh, just a great review of every, everything you learned in college there. Uh, and let me, let me iterate this. This book is very well written. It is very uh, easy to follow, easy to understand. It gives you step by step of uh, when you should use certain equations and maybe what cases you don't want to use certain equations. Uh, after that, it goes into uh, mechanical engineering topics. Uh, and there's basically three uh, main branches here. The first would be uh, fluid mechanics and extensive, extensive research uh, there. They even got a section on uh, rocket propulsion, which is pretty cool. So after that, you go on to thermodynamics where you study thermodynamics and heat transfer, power plant cycles and stuff like that. This book is so well written that even I understood the radiation part and I'm I've kind of lost when it comes to that. So. Uh, like I said, very good reference. And then after that, we move on to uh, you know the solids portion of uh, engineering, or mechanical engineering as well, uh, where you talk about uh, stress and strain, you talk about uh, machine design, machine design components, and you go through a lot of uh, just really good, solid, easy to understand reference material. So without going through this page by page, um, Man, I, I highly suggest you get a copy of this and hey, make your boss pay for it. He'll do it. It's a good reference, okay? But don't tell him I said to do it, okay? Anyway, um, I have this on my website. If you want to go through it and look at it, go to mentorengineer.com slash resources. Thank you. Have a great day.